And new information on a deadly small plane crash in Arizona. 7 News learning two of the people on board, a retired Denver police officer and his wife. There were no survivors. New at 10, 7 News reporter Molly Hendrickson sitting down with a close friend of the couple. Yeah, Michael Hughes seen here, Todd, gun safety. Now, this is their website, Raven Company, that he and his wife owned. You can see it was a company dedicated to training and the carrying of a concealed handgun and the safe use of firearms. We're told that they split their time between Arizona and Colorado. The plane took off Friday from Bullhead City, Arizona. Tonight, we still don't know what went so wrong. From the sky, you can see what little was left of the plane carrying Michael Hughes and his wife. Witnesses say the Cessna 340 clipped some trees while flying over northern Arizona, exploding on impact. At first, you're hoping that mm, maybe there's a mistake. Sergeant Virginia Quinones is an old friend of the couple, working alongside Michael until he retired as a lieutenant from the Denver Police Department in 2007. In every area he worked, he made friends. He made those close relationships. Hughes was a retired major from the U.S. Army Reserves. He had a passion for guns, teaching firearms training, but it was his wife, Joy, who had his heart. These two were inseparable. Best of friends, husband, wife, did everything together. The Hughes never lacked for friends. Pictures show them vacationing together, Mike with his contagious smile, his bride always by his side. It's those memories Quinones will miss the most. The last text from Mike was, so hey, where are we going to go next year? That's the thing that is kind of hitting us that we won't. It was nice that we had the times together that we did. And the other two people on the plane were told were from Texas. Still no word on a memorial service for the Hughes. Molly Hendrickson, 7 News.